How's it going guys? In today's YouTube video, we're gonna be going over what it takes to back up the data on your Mac computer using an external hard drive with using the built-in Apple backup system called Time Machine. Let's go ahead and check out to see how it's done. Backing up your data on your Mac computer is very a simplified process. Apple is one to ensure that no data loss occurs with their customers. So making a backup system that's relatively easy to use and operate is the idea behind making sure that people aren't losing a bunch of data. Let's get right into showing you exactly how the backup is performed on this MacBook Air here. The first step, you're going to want to go ahead and connect the drive you would like to use to your computer using a USB cable or whatever cable that it comes with. When you connect your drive for the first time, the computer will actually prompt you what you would like to do with the drive once it is connected. You will have the option to not use it as a time machine backup, and then you will have the option to use it as a time machine backup. Simply select the option, use as backup to use it as a backup. And that's all it takes. The first backup will take some time as it's copying the entire contents of the computer to the external drive. Subsequent backups will only ask the drive what has changed and apply changes to the drive as needed. So again, subsequent backups will not take as long as the initial backup did. When you're performing backups on your day-to-day -day use, to check for backup status, it is very easy. Open up the system preferences section in the computer like we did previously and then navigate to the bottom to Time Machine. One of the options in the Time Machine Preferences window will be the option to display an icon at the top of the screen at the right next to the time, date, and other Wi-Fi controls so it is very easy to check for backup status and when they are ongoing. Keep in mind also that when backups are being performed, you're welcome to use your computer as normal. However, it is recommended to be connected to the charger when you are performing your backups. Now that your backup's been created, if your Mac computer has a problem, or say if you get a new Mac computer, you will use the backup to reinstitute the new Mac computer as if you lost nothing. It'll bring you back literally right where you left off on your old computer. You may just have to type in your username and passwords for a few things or license keys, but in any case, Time Machine really aims to get you right back where you left off so you can get working. In conclusion, we can certainly recommend performing backups in general on any device that you own to prevent data loss. And it's very easily so done when you have Time Machine on a Mac computer, it's simply a plug and play process. You hit one button and done, and everything's backed up. So if you like what you saw in today's video, please drop us a like and also leave us a comment letting us know how we did. Please hit the notification bell icon next to the subscription button so you're subscribed and getting notifications when we upload videos like this one. Again, thank you for watching the YouTube channel, The Apple Exchange, and have a wonderful rest of your day.